Hello students, welcome to Swapna Physics classes. In this lecture, I am going to explain you one more important short answer question for TS Intermediate Second Year IPE examination. And the question is explain the formation of my ridges. What are my ridges? My ridges are simply an illusion and these are these are formed due to total internal reflection total internal reflection and this total internal reflection is possible only when the light ray travels from the denser medium to the rarer medium and whenever the angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle critical angle the total internal reflection takes place because of the total internal reflection marriages are formed if you assume that this is the surface of the earth in hot summer what happens the temperature of the surface of the earth increases the temperature of the surface of the earth increases and as a result the temperature of the air near to the surface of the earth also increases okay and because of the increase of the temperature the air particles will move in upward direction and the density near the surface of the earth decreases and the air layer which is above to this air layer the air layer which is above above this air layers density increases as a particle move as the particles of the air moves in upward direction the density of the air above this layer increases and as the temperature transmission takes place as the temperature transmission takes place from this layer to the above layer what happens the temperature of this layer also increases and again the particles from this layer will move in upward direction and here the temp density decreases and here the density increases and the temperature transmission takes place and as the increase of the temperature the air particles moves in upward direction and the density here increases and the density here decreases. As a result what happens? The different layers of the air are formed. Different layers of the air are formed. This is the surface of the earth. Okay. And the different, these are the different layers of the air. These are the different layers of the air. And as you move in upward direction, the density of the different layers of the air increases. The density increases as you move in upward direction. Okay. And whenever the light ray travels from the higher denser medium to the lower denser medium, what happens? What happens? The refractor ray will bend away from the normal. I will explain this. For example, I have a tree here. Okay. And here we have an observer. If this observer is observing this tree from a far distance, from a far distance, not close to this tree. If he is far away from this tree and he is observing the tree, what happens? I am taking a light ray, okay, and this light ray is traveling from this higher denser medium to the lower denser medium, okay. If you compare both these mediums, this is higher denser than this layer of the air. This layer is higher denser than this layer of the air, and if this is the normal to this interface. What happens? This light ray will bend away from the normal. This is the refracted angle. This is the incident angle. And whenever a light ray travels from the denser medium to the rarer medium, angle of refraction will be greater than the angle of incidence. We know that. I explained this point in our previous class only in total internal reflection. Okay. And this is the interface interface of two different layers of the air. 
and when you compare the densities of these two layers the density of this layer is greater than the density of this layer now what happens this light ray will furtherly bends away from the normal will bend away from the normal okay this will be the incident ray this will be the refractor ray and whenever whenever the angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle whenever the angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle what happens total internal reflection takes place whenever the angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle total internal reflection takes place there is no refractor ray only there is a reflector ray this is the reflector ray and this is the incident ray this is reflect reflector angle and this is incident angle there is no refraction possible only refre reflection is possible which is known as total internal reflection okay and whenever this light ray reaches the eye of the observer okay and we know that the light the light ray always 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 travels in a straight line always travels in a straight line okay in our 10th class we learned this when we know that the light ray travels in a straight line and if you extend this line if you extend this straight line okay what happens he feels that the light ray is coming from this point not from this point this is the straight line and he feels that the light ray is traveling in a straight line and it is coming from this point and he will observe the image of this point at this point okay here he will observe the image of this tree which is inverted which is inverted the image of the tree is inverted and whenever you observe an image of some tree or a building in a pool of water what happens the image of this tree will be inverted okay so that he feels that there are water there is a pond of water at this point and hence he feels that he is observing the image of a tree in water in water okay and which is nothing but an illusion this is simply an illusion actually there there is no water in in desert what happens whenever an observer observes uh, the far part of the distance he feels that there is a pond but whenever he moves towards that point what happens there is no pond actually in reality there is no pond is just because of the density of the different layers of the earth air density of the different layers of the air okay and this is simply an illusion which is nothing but mirages okay mirages are formed due to different densities of the air layers and these are formed due to total internal reflection between these different air layers because of the rise in temperature because of the rise in temperature okay here i will end our lecture and whoever didn't subscribe to my channel please click on the subscribe button and also click on the like button and share with maximum number of people possible okay bye